Ooh, G girl. Um. Hello dolls, it is she and welcome back to my channel. This week I have a fun video for you. I am coming at you with a $15.99, yes, $15.99 synthetic wig that I got off of Amazon. Girl, look at her. She's cute. She's cute and she cute. And we're not gonna waste any time. We're gonna go ahead and jump into it. So if you wanna see how I slay this $15.99 La Synthetical wig from Amazon, you know what to do. Keep on watching. Okay, so let's open this bad boy up. It comes in your typical Amazon package. I am a Prime member, honey, so I got this here in two days. And I have not peeked in it. I want to open it here and get sort of a first impressions. Um, but okay, it comes in a little bag here. It is W and J, Nicole, oh wait, what's the N? Excuse me, N and J, Nicole and Tulip is the brand here. And it comes in a pretty thick, nice um, protective bag. So let's uh, open this bad boy up. It looks like there's some goodies in here. It comes with a um, neck cap. And then it comes with a, just a little thank you card and um, some easy to use instructions and the link to the company's website. And I'm assuming that the wig must have come out of this little neck because it's just kind of in here and you pull it out and here is the unit. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and zoom in on this so you guys can see the unit. Um, the weight, the length, the color, and the, the SKU number in case you are interested in this towards the end of the video. But it comes with a little tag on it. It fell out of the net because there's no net protecting this. It's just kind of thrown in there. Um, comes with some little wrappings in the inside to, I guess, supposedly hold the shape. Let's get into the structure. The structure is actually um, pretty solid. So it has a comb here in the back. It has a pretty thick net. It's actually really, really thick. Um, and then it has some little adjustable straps in the inside as well. Oh, actually that comb is in the front. So there's a comb in the front um, and then there's adjustable straps here in the back and that looks like it's the only comb. So the structure isn't bad at all. There's This is the front, so there's absolutely no lace on this wig at all. So um, however you decide to wear it, just keep that in mind. There is no lace on this wig and this is a synthetic wig, so I wasn't expecting it, but just get some little tidbits. So I just went ahead and ripped that rip that off. Um, and let's just let's just go in, I guess. Let's I already got you know my cap on and just my edges out. I'm gonna go ahead and adjust the wig in the back to about uh, how I think my head would fit and I have a small head so I'm gonna pull it all the way to the center and I'm actually gonna overlap the straps in the back to make it kind of tight. You want it to be a little a little snug. So this is how I have mine in the back and then it's pretty stretchy so let's plop her on oh girl um okay okay so okay let's we looking real uh i don't even know right now but it's, it's okay no problem we're gonna get her get her together so i'm gonna lift up here and take those comb, that comb that's in the front right here, and I'm gonna tuck that underneath my cap for a little bit of security, and I'm gonna push her back off of my hairline. So, right where my baby hairs are, that's where I push that back. So, this is what we are working with. <laughs> oh, girl! This is a little crazy. Okay, it's not terrible, it's not god awful. This is what we're working with so far, so I'm gonna tease these curls, I'm gonna go in, I'm gonna separate the curls first things first. So after I separate the curls, then I'm gonna go in with my scissors and probably try to reshape it. So let's get to separate some of these curls and I'll be right back.
okay so this is where we are where we've like kind of halfway uh, teased out one side and this is the side that has been completely untouched completely unteased and I gotta say I'm actually really liking this I was not expecting anything from this $15 wig but I'm actually really really liking this um now for me uh, as you tease it but it is synthetic hair it does kind of kind of snag a little bit and it creates frizz but for me that is exactly what I kind of wanted it's perfectly fine with me because I want it to look more natural and not those very spiral curly cues that that it kind of comes in as really really shiny this gives it more texture and it gives it um more of a natural look and a natural feel and obviously it makes it bigger and I absolutely love 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 big hair so this is doing exactly what I wanted to do and um, the wig actually already has like a nice shape as you can see there's shorter curls here in the front so it already has like a natural um, shape to it. it has a natural bang cut into it which is great so all you saw as I was doing I was going through separating out these curls and kind of picking through it with my fingers I even went through with my big comb and teased it a little bit at the root to get even more volume on it and so far I'm actually really 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 liking how this is um, this is looking so I'm gonna go ahead and I'm gonna finish teasing out this other side and then keep on watching I'll be right back Okay, so here she is all picked out guys, and I must say I'm pretty impressed with this wig. I'm going to do a quick spin for you so you can see the entire head. And she's a little misshapen from picking her out, so I'm going to go in with my scissors, and I'm just going to take some off where I see fit, just to kind of A-frame my face a little bit. See, a little bit right here can go some long pieces that we can get out of there there see do you see that that instantly just gave that so much more shape you know what this is who this is giving me this is giving me miss tracy ellis ross like is anybody else getting joan i'm gonna call her tracy her name is tracy or should i call her joan love girlfriends i'm gonna call her tracy you know every week you know every week i have a good name so her name is going to be tracy she's giving me very much so Tracy Ellis Ross and I absolutely love it look at that look at that shape it just got oh that is so pretty so let's go ahead and finish shaping her off and I, there's no really no rhyme or reason to my cut I'm just kind of pulling it out and um, cutting where I feel necessary and only taking like about half inch to an inch off at a time don't don't go too ham with it because then you'll be too far gone and you can't get get a good shape back so oh look at that look at that that is so like the shape is perfect over there so let's go ahead and get this side looking more like that side so let's take some of that off mm-hmm mm -hmm. this wig honestly it didn't require a lot I thought I was gonna take this thing out the packet and it was just gonna need like a whole operation but it really did not need a lot and for $15.99 girl can't beat this with a stick. Tried to back out some weirdness going on, so let's pull some of that out. Get some of that off. And if it's too big for you, you can definitely not tease it as much and definitely um, shear it out some because it's a lot of curls in here. I'm trying not to go too crazy with it because I can already feel myself going a little, a little too crazy. I'm just going to shape it just a little bit more here towards my face. Fluff it out a little bit more right here. And child, you have a whole do. $15.99. Two minutes to throw this baby on once you get the shape that you like and once you fluff it out how you like. Girl, you can throw on a whole hairdo in two seconds. This is, um, keep in mind, a synthetic wig. So I would definitely not sleep in this wig. I would definitely not put any water, any heat or anything to this wig. You want to wear her, take her off at night, put her to sleep, 
and then put her back on in the morning but I think that this wig can get a lot of wear I think that you'll definitely get your money's worth 10 times over like I'm actually really impressed with this little synthetic wig like she's she's cute she's really cute she's really bouncy now one last thing I want to do is go in with my um organics argan oil and just a it gives it a subtle shine but b it takes away that sort of synthetic plastic smell and it gives a more natural smell like this just smells like every natural hair girl's dream so this was a very short and very sweet video i was just perusing on amazon like i do late at night and came across this synthetic wig for 15.99 i'm like okay let me give it a try see if it's worth it and um i will say get it i will 100 recommend it so i hope that you dolls enjoyed this video go ahead and jump down in the comment section i'm having so much fun with these hair tutorials you have absolutely no idea i should switch my channel from makeup to hair a lot sooner but we're here we're doing the damn thing um go ahead like like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you dolls in my next video.